We had a little bit of Hollywood happening in our very own backyard. Steph Jones took us to the red carpet at the Denver Film Festival where she got an exclusive interview with Jamie Dornan, a.k.a. Christian Grey. We okay, Tori, we spoke with him about his new movie, and you won't believe what Steph got him to do. Mm -hmm. That's today's Chatting with the Stars on the red carpet. I'm Stephanie Jones here with Daily Blast Live at Denver's Film Festival, where I'm going to be interviewing the one and only Jamie Dornan for the showcase of his new movie, Belfast. I am so excited. It's going to be amazing. I can't wait. I'm so excited. Jamie's here. He's talking to us next. I'm going to try and make him say, wish me luck. Jamie, thank you so much for chatting with me tonight. I'm so excited that you're here in Denver. Now, last night at the premiere, you just burst out in a rendition of Everlasting Love, which completely rocked. What was it that made you get up on that stage? Had you had a few drinks? Was it a bet? I'd had uh, <laughs> a bet. Um, I think I had just the right amount. I had a couple of vodka martinis and a, maybe a glass of white wine. I never drink white wine. And it was enough. It had been sort of mooted the idea that uh, I would maybe get up and I said, listen, I'll see how I feel on the night. And uh, yeah, I was just the right level of pissed and got up there and uh, yeah, I think it went down okay. I don't know. It went down a tree. Are you kidding me? Yeah. It was okay. Yeah, it was fun. I think you've got a karaoke song for life now. That would be really embarrassing if I spent my life doing that song. Okay, for fair enough, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Will you sing a line of Everlasting Love with me? I'll sing it. All right. Open up your eyes. Then you'll realize. Here I stand with my everlasting love. Need you by my side. Oh, yeah. Girl to be my bride. I want that bit. Never be denied. Everlasting love. Open up your eyes. about Belfast, it's a little bit more than coincidental that you took on the role as Pa in the movie. So how does that line up with your experience growing up in Northern Ireland? It all resonates, you know. Uh, you can't be from that part of the world and not be affected by a conflict that went on for 30 years. And uh, But uh, for me, the chance to tell this story and to be a small part and to be able to, after 50 years, let this story out and. Uh, and show a different side of that part of the world. You know, we've seen Belfast depicted many times on screen before in Academy Award moving, uh, winning movies that Jim Sheridan directed over the years, whatever, but, but never like this and never through the eyes of a nine-year-old. And I think that's what makes it interesting. This is the time to think about making a new start. I know nothing else but Belfast. Exactly. There's a whole world out there. You worked alongside the Queen, Dame Judi Dench. What was it like working with her? And were there, were there any like little weird oddities or cute little hobbies or things that you picked up about her that we might not know about? Kieran Hines, who plays my dad in it, uh, Judy plays my mum, and Kieran says something lovely about Judy. It's like she's a rebel, and that pretty much sums her up. You know, she's just always on the edge of something, yeah, something fun happening. You know, and she's obviously such a titan of an actress. You know, and um, to be around that and feel that energy every day, it's it's amazing. But she's fun above everything else. I appreciate it. Thank you so much.